Welcome to the Bite Size Storytelling Show, brought to you by Comiful.com, where we bring you techniques, advice, and stories that will help you on your writing journey. Without further ado, please give a warm welcome to our special guest. Hi, Comaful. I'm Renita De Silva, author of um, historical. I write historical fiction. I've written nine books, and The Orphan's Gift is my latest. Uh, I'm here to tell you about creating characters. Um, one of the things I learned when creating believable characters, uh, when I first started writing, um, this was the feedback I got from all um, all um, the editors and agents I sent my book to. They said that either my, my characters were too black and white, they were either too good or too bad, the villains were too bad, the, uh, the, you know, the heroes were too good. Um, there was no, they, were, they didn't have shades of grey, so they weren't very believable, they were just too nice. Um, and I still do that, even nine books on, my um, heroes tend to be a bit too nice. So when I send my first draft in, the editor comes back and says, please, could you go over this and make the, um, you know, make the hero a bit more believable, a bit more human. So what I would, um, the tip I would give you all is to make your uh, protagonists a bit, uh, uh, make them human. So give them some good qualities, uh, uh, good qualities, but some you know, uh, like all human beings, some bad qualities too, which um, uh, the other thing, uh, sorry, which, um, you know, makes them more believable so uh, the reader can relate to them. The other thing I would say is that um, by the end of the book, um, a re uh, the protagonist should change in some way. Um, so even if they are very bad in the beginning and um, like in my latest book, um, many, uh, I have two protagonists in my latest book and one of them um, is really somebody very selfish and nobody, uh, most of the readers didn't like her at all at the beginning. But by the end of the book, um, they do warm to her because she grows, she grows uh, over the course of the book. And by the end of it, she begins to see that she has been too selfish and she uh, learns and she grows, um, she changes. So um, make the, basically, uh, this is my next uh, one more tip is make the character, make your protagonist go on a journey um, of self-discovery. Uh, they learn something at the end, they change in some way. Um, and this way, um, the reader also goes on the journey with them. So this, these are my tips that I wanted to tell you. One was make the um, protagonist believable and secondly, make them go on a journey so that uh, they change in some way by the end of the story. Uh, thank you. Uh, it's lovely to be here uh, on Comaful. Um, I'm Renita De Silva and I've written, as I said, uh, I write historical fiction. The Orphan's Gift is my latest book. Thank you. Bye. If you found this interesting, be sure to like, subscribe, and give a special thanks to our volunteer instructor. Reviews and likes really go a long way and help us provide more awesome writing resources to the Comiful community. If you aren't on Comiful yet, you can join a community of poets, short story authors, and fan fiction writers on Comiful.com.